r slash ask reddit what old video games do you still play regularly until recently age of empires 2 only reason i stopped was because i switched to definitive edition when it came out roller coaster tycoon the og 1999 one it stands up really well gameplay wise tetris just got into tetris 99 the battle royale system is terrifying but addictive diablo 2 greetings stranger i'm not surprised to see your kind around here the secret of monkey island i've spoken with apes more polite than you how appropriate you fight like a cow i have yearly playthroughs of ocarina of time a link to the past and chrono trigger and i haven't gotten bored of them after all these years a link to the past was probably the first game i ever beat or perhaps super metroid same for me i love super metroid should probably play that again soon space pinball on windows where can i get that game i used to play it on xp but i haven't been able to find it for years san andreas i sometimes love to play it and drive around the city and cry for the old days isn't it funny how every time you start a new game when cj is coming back to the hood to start the main story you the player are also coming back to the hood the old alleyways and shortcuts the old cluck and bell you threw up in the old park where the drive-by happened the graphics will get old but the story never will cj is in his 50s 60s in 2020 hope he still ain't a buster quake doom starcraft i just got the og doom for my switch a few days ago and played a bit with my sister it's a nice walk down memory lane i play through the baldur's gate series every year or two it's still my favorite series of all time was looking for this baldur's gate 1 and 2 were some of my earliest exposures to the medieval fantasy genre and rose tinted glasses be damned they still hold up john r renicus is among the best villains in gaming Super Mario 64. Now I have the castle music stuck in my head. Yahoo. Yahoo. More aligned. Team Fortress 2. Doc. Come on man. Runescape. I got back into old shul like 2 years ago when I heard they released it on mobile and now I'm 3200 hours deep and have 7 skill capes. And I can't remember the last time I played a video game that wasn't OSRS. Dude I swore off RuneScape forever, until it hit iOS, then I jumped back into it, made an iron, and never looked back lol, cheers. You never truly quit RuneScape, you just take breaks of different lengths. The Simpsons hit and run. I'm soaring like a candy wrapper in an updraft. The Sims 2, everything about it is perfect to me, the music especially, it has a goofiness and warmth we don't see much these days. And the modding community is quite active too. Sims 2 is my favorite game ever. I feel like the newer games are lacking some of the humor and whimsy of Sims 1 and 2. Kota. It's an iOS now so you can play mobile. Still the two best Star Wars games of all time. Sad that they put a stop to the fan remake. The trailers looked ask me anything zing. Does Kota run smooth on mobile? Runs well. Movement controls take a little getting used to but since combat is turn based it's not a huge issue. Worth it for the nostalgia. Command and Conquer Red Alert 2. LOL I still play Yuri's Revenge like once a week. Pretty sure there's still an online community but I usually just play skirmish. Fallout NV. Feels like I always find something new. Well, I'm about due for another playthrough of the Mass Effect trilogy. Yes. Yes, I gotta do it again. I haven't done every romance yet, and I didn't have the mental strength to go full paragon in all three games. Portal. Hellion man. The Portal games are so replayable, especially the first one. I could beat Portal 1 a thousand times and not get bored of it. 007. Nightfire. Oh man. My buddies and I used to play the multiplayer all night. Setting all the bots as your accuser and laughing our asses off when they would get stuck running into a wall. Ratchet and Clank. I've been playing through a game recently and I can't think of any game that's just as plain fun to play. I also recently learned that doing flips in front of the hoverboard girl in Blackwater City will make her tits grow. The original Fable. 
Hero, your health is low. Do you have any potions? Or food? Try to get your combat multiplier even higher. You've received a new quest card. Little Big Planet. That game is so nostalgic. I recommend those who haven't played it to definitely do so. Oh. And Raymond. That game is incredibly fun. D. Little Big Planet on Aesthetic alone is one of my top 5 favorite games of all time. The platforming just elevates it, and the community content is ducking godlike. Heroes of Might and Magic 3. Minesweeper. Classic. It's a shame it's not a default game on Windows anymore. I used to play it on the school computers. It's available online. If you want to play a local version, try one of the clones that are acceptable for world records. Several Pokemon games. Total Annihilation. KOTOR 2. I did not expect to see Total Annihilation. One of the greatest games of all time to me and one of the only old games I still play. Armor Core? LEGO Star Wars. The Complete Saga. It's a perfect game. Pokemon Emerald. GBA. And Star Fox Adventures. GameCube. I'm a sucker for older, early 2000s, Nintendo games. Edit. Ew it's so awesome to see so much Pokemon Emerald and SF Adventures love. Pokemon Emerald was the first game I ever saved up for and bought with my own money. I was in 5th grade. Star Fox Adventures was gifted to me along with the used GameCube my dad found at a market for like $50 back in 2005-ish. Greatest day of my life lol. Yoshi's Island is fantastic. Just started playing it last year. I would always put it off because I thought that baby Mario's crying would be too obnoxious to deal with. Big mistake. The game is great. Moro Island. The combat is terrible and the graphics are shitty but I love the lore, music, environments and story so much. Half-Life 2 not that old but still platinum. Isn't it 15 years old? Released 16th November 2004. Same age as my Steam account. Having waited for it since Christmas 1998 when we got the original Half-Life. If every couple years counts as regularly, then Bioshock and Bioshock 2. Mario Kart Wii. Road Rash. Skyrim. Some people never stopped even after almost a decade. Assassin's Creed 2 I love everything about it it could also be Halo Reach for me. Minecraft is 11 years old, so I guess that, I'd also keep playing more Gen 3 Pokemon games. But no internet connectivity makes it a moot point for me. Hope Gen 4 gets a remake soon. Age of Empires 2. Rollercoaster Tycoon 2. I still play Modern Warfare 2, at least 10 hours per week, believe it or not. Online lobbies are still plentiful, complete with the trash talk and intermission fights. N64 games, Goldeneye, Pokemon Snap, Stadium, Banjo-Kazooie, DK64, and Ocarina of Time. Left for Dead. Starcraft. Heroes of Might and Magic 3. Luigi's Mansion. Chrono Trigger. Paper Mario and Paper Mario TTYD. Fallout 2. Super Mario Bros 3. Skate 3 if that counts lol. If not Jjbar heritage for the future. Mega Man X. Neopets. Whoa, you made it to the end? You're a ducking beast. I'll cut you a deal. Smash like and subscribe for more curated content bruh. It's free and that's a great price.